Hey guys, I'm back, and this is my review for the movie Mongol, which comes out on DVD this week. And uh, since I work at Blockbuster, I get them beforehand, so I just figured that since I've been waiting to see this since it was in limited release over the summer, I think, and it's finally out on DVD, I decided to see it. Um, this movie pretty much follows the origins of Genghis Khan and his uh, how he became who he was before he went on his like world conquering you know campaign and surprisingly this is a very very good movie I mean I, I, want, I figured it'd be good but I didn't think it would be this good I really really liked it um, the the action scenes, the battle scenes are very well done, especially for a movie that's, well, I'm guessing it's Mongolian, maybe Chinese, I don't know. I, th I think it's Mongolian. Since it's called Mongol, it wouldn't surprise me at all. But uh, it was nominated for the best foreign feature film last year. It didn't win. Um, what, what won? The Counterfeiters won, uh, which is a pretty good movie. But this one... Uh, it, it really captures that epic feel that, that movies like Lord of the Rings and Gladiator and um, Kingdom of Heaven, movies like that, uh, capture really well. And I, I'm glad because I haven't seen a movie like those in a while. So uh, I was really happy to see a good movie that really gets um, the big epic scale down. It's not as big as the, one, the other movies I mentioned. Um, but there are three major battle sequences that are really good. They're really well done, really well um, choreographed, very good cinematography. Um, the actors are very, very good. Um, generally, everything in this movie is great, it, with the exception of one thing, which is very unfortunate, but there's at least one, maybe two circumstances where a battle should have been longer. The movie's a little bit longer than two hours, but I think they could have extended some of the battles to where uh, maybe about 10 more minutes because you know Kingdom of Heaven, Lord of the Rings, Gladiator, those are longer movies and I think they could have done with a, a few more battle sequences or at least one or two more one or two of the battle sequences be a little more extended because some of them sort of just end and you're like you want to see more it kind of leaves you hanging a little bit but other than that I think it's a very very good movie I'm gonna give it three and a half stars I definitely recommend you rent this when it comes out definitely so that's my review for Mongol very 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 good movie